Welcome to the practice videos. Today we're going to do the song Presto by Greif. And this one is in 3-8 time. And it's this really cool thing. It'll remind you a little of a, a fiddle song. Before I've talked about how valuable it is to choose a song that you really like. And once you know it, play it once a day. And then just keep playing it to see, you know, how fast can I play this? So this would fall into that category. It would work great for it. I'm not going to play it super fast, even in the performance tempo, because it's important to be able to hear what the song is doing. But on your own, you can take this one as pretty much as fast as you want. That little bit that I did at the end where I slow down, sometimes you will see an RIT period in the music. <clears throat> and that's short for retardando, which means to slow down. It happens a lot at the end of songs because um, it makes it final, you know, finished. And then the audience knows when to clap. <laughs> so a lot of songs, they slow down just a little bit at the end or, you know, dramatically that way. Uh, it's a very effective way to end a song. So I slipped that in there, even though it's not in the music. All right, practice tempo. This I won't go through all the way with the da capo. I'll just play down the page so you can work with it, okay? One, ready, go. Okay, from here, we're going to do our duet. I'll sort of go over medium speed here. And some of the notes, um, some of the notes in the duet part are held out while the melody plays and they start on the same note. So when you do it with the duet, somebody else can hold that out. Uh, I've got to make room for the other fingers. So that's why that disappears a little bit, just so it doesn't throw you off.
and the duet part by itself. One, ready, play. And there's your presto. I hope you enjoy playing it. I really like that piece. We'll look forward to catching up with you soon. We're going to do one more Haydn piece, and that'll wrap up our 12 lessons. Really appreciate that you came by and you spent time with the recordings. We do have a live class that happens each week to help people out, give them a chance to perform. And when you perform your piece, it's almost like having three lessons. It pushes you forward a lot. So that's one of the reasons why we have a live, live class. And you're welcome to join at any time. Thank you so much.